I'm really pleased to show you guys the start of Twin Mirror. This game does not launch until the 1st of December on Epic Games Store, PS4, Xbox One. There will be a pre-order link in the description below. If you guys want to pre-order it for yourself, use my creator code as well. I appreciate it. So Don't Nod have also sponsored this video, but it also works on Life is Strange, Tell Me Why, and that's why I'm very, very excited for this game. Ever since I saw the first trailer, I've been hyped for this game. We're playing it extra early. It doesn't come out until next month, a whole month early. Hope you guys enjoyed this first episode. If we turn this into a full series, this will be the first part, and then we'll continue into the second part. Thank you guys for watching. Enjoy the video, and let's commence. Also, I forgot to mention, if you guys pre-order the game, you get the soundtrack completely for free. Oh, yes. The skies are finally clearing up after a light rain fell most of the afternoon. The weather's approaching 49 degrees, so we've got a brisk West Virginia evening ahead of us. Wrap up tight and settle in, folks. This is 104.3 WBCK, the Bassman Sound. I'm your host, Carrie Hammond. Coming up after a short break, mental health expert Dr. Wood will discuss the recent opioid epidemic that's been affecting. Take my clothes and wash my mind. Does the wind go down that low? Let me breathe and I'll let you go. I look down in desperation. I feel the ground for something real. There's a radio station. I'm playing wrong in my ear. You keep coming alive, keep coming alive, keep coming alive, keep coming alive. Time to kill before the funeral. Might as well spend it here. This place was always one for decisions. Somewhere for things to fall apart. Restoration sign. Yeah, I do love how companies do that. <laughs> if they work on a piece of environment or whatever, they're always like, yeah, we did this. We did, we did this good deed. Yeah, okay, great. Very subtle. Okay. Yeah, ever since I saw the first trailer for this game, it's one of those games you watch the trailer, you're like, okay, that, that, that game is now officially on my radar right now. I came up here every chance I could. One of the all-time great views. Really makes a small town look big. A view of Basewood. His hometown, he's not been here for a long, long time, but he's back. I'm not sure Nick would even want me at his funeral, given how I left things. Ah, so Nick's the reason we came back. Okay. I remember spending entire summers on the banks fishing with Nick. They seem fairly close, but why is he so resentful about coming back? He seems so. My angry hometown. About it. it felt more imposing in my nightmares. Maybe something happened here. Strange to think of basswood without its mine. So it's not basswood, it's basswood. Is that right? But have I been saying it wrong? Oh, God, Scott. Okay, fine. <laughs> Oh, shoot. Of course I have a warning sign. Doesn't look very sturdy, yeah. The railings seem to have dropped. Great. Are we going up there, then? Oh, Emergency phone. Okay, that's noted. Got it. 
little bit of wildlife. What we got? Field mice, red foxes, flying squirrels, cave bats, black bears. Okay then. Food locker in there. I left a sandwich in it for a whole week once. Dad never let me forget it. I used to love looking at basswood from up here. It gave me perspective. Until that day. Until what day? What happened? Through the spyglass. Basswood. Oh, what? Why can't the real world be as clear and peaceful as my own mind? So has he had some kind of... Even if it does mean nothing stays hidden in here. Not even me. Some kind of accident and he's got these... Uh abilities to almost go in his head and analyze and have clear thoughts and I don't know what's going on right now. How's he doing this? Pac-Man! Uh, oh cool. I've been meaning to ask you something. Don't freak out. Would you be my little girl's godfather? I, I wouldn't trust anyone else with this. And yet I stopped taking his calls. He even called once the day before he died. I'll never know what he wanted to talk to me about. Pac-Man's in the game. Now I'm interested. <laughs> Another memory. This is Anna. She works freelance. Uh, does a lot of the human interest pieces. What can I say? I'm interested in humans and their pieces. <laughs> what do you like to write? I gotta run to a review with Walt. You two feel free to chit chat. And Sam, be nice. I had never met someone so interested in others, even in me. Seems like a nice person. The story is important. You know I think that. It's just. People around here have short tempers and long memories. Be careful. Sam, are you even listening to me? I heard you, Anna. But no, I wasn't listening. Maybe he was trying to push a story. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, maybe, and it just... The people didn't like it. Oh, so this is where we are right now. Through the spyglass. Come on, Anna, look at this. <laughs> what is it? Someone skinny dipping? Anna, you really need smooth. to see this. That is smooth. I can't even see. Something's blocking it. That is smooth. Sam, what are you doing? I'm trying to be romantic. What? Wait. Please don't tell me you're proposing. I'm down on one knee, a ring. What else would I be doing? You look like I just ran over your grandma. Okay, the silence is really starting to scare me now. Anna, please say something. Sam, put that away. Come on. I don't want a ring. I don't need a ring. You should know that. We've discussed it before. Oh, that was good. That was yeah. We weren't happy. 
She was the one brave enough to face that. Lost in my head again. How much time did I miss? How long was he out for? Seemed like quite a long time. I guess we're going back to the car, right? Whoa, that was some serious rejection right there. It seems like they sort of both knew I they weren't very the happy. Maybe it's for the best. On the bright side, Nick's not alive for me to let him down again. He just went inside his head and just the time just disappeared. Should we reply? Sorry, Walter, but I don't think I'll stick around. Given up already? Just a quick, depressing jaunt down memory lane and then you're gone? I know you think that the only thing waiting for you down there is hurt. Lots of hurt. And you might be right. But it's been two years. It's time to face the world. Time to adult. The good news, though, at least you don't have to do it alone. Are you talking to yourself? nightmare as a guy. <laughs> I still come in. Um, I'm almost there. I'm coming. I promise. That's the lost line. the signal. Something never change. Get going, man. up here for? I need to work out. I don't know if we acknowledged the time early on, but it felt like a long time. It was quite bright and he left when the sun was going down. How long was that? A couple of hours? came it's been a while you've gotten taller can we talk we're talking right now it's cold So... You left. Joan, that's not fair. You left. Okay. Um, let's talk about this. Calm down, please. I don't really want to talk about this right now. <laughs> you don't want to talk about this? What are you, my age? I'm not here for very long. I don't want to fight about the mistakes I've made. Well, my dad died. I'm angry, and I want to fight about it. I don't. And it takes two people to fight. You're a jerk, and I'm gonna talk about it. It's been hard. My mom's been distant, even before all of this. I wish my dad was still here. I wish kids in class liked me. I wish you hadn't left. I wish a lot of things. Well, I don't know how much me staying would have helped. 
You're the only one around here that doesn't treat me like a kid. You are a kid. Doesn't mean I like to be treated like one. Listen, I, uh... I wanted to talk to you about what happened to Dad. It doesn't make sense. He wouldn't have just crashed. He drove like a grandma, you know that. It's... wrong. I don't buy it. I'm just in town for the funeral, Joan. I'm not a P.I. or a cop. You're the closest thing I can talk to. Will you just look into it, Muley? Please? She wants her father's death to mean something. But where does that lead? What if it leads to the truth? That could change everything. An hour ago, you wanted to run away. Now you want to start another investigation? A few questions won't hurt anyone. Just tonight. To reassure her. And myself. This is a wake. If you poke around, people may end up poking back. Okay, whatever you do, at least leave the kid out of it. It would be cruel to lead her on. Friends don't lie to each other, even if it means disappointing her again. It's your call. Who are you? So it seems to be, I guess, is that the twin mirror? Is that, the, is that what's going on right now? Okay, is that the... The twin with the glasses. I think we, we should look into it. That feels like the right thing to do. She wants help. We ran away. She deserves to... Yeah, we'll look into it. Okay. I'll see what I can see and all that. Gumshoe it up. You will? You make some good points. It doesn't fit. I hate when things don't fit. Yeah, me too. I might just be... I don't know, crazy or something, but... You want to know for sure. I get it. Thanks, Muley. I, um... I should go in before my mom misses me. You better get in there, too. Can't hide in your car all night. Who says I'm hiding out here? I do. See you inside. Come on, Sam, let's get in there. Let's ask a few questions. There's a lot to unpack here. <laughs> I'm trying to work it out as we go. I'll get there eventually. Going in, finally. Uh, Might as well talk to Walter. I'll have to sooner or later. Love these little prompts as well. Is he actually seeing those as well? Some of the police force stopped by, which means most of the police force stopped by. Ah, the police force isn't exactly big then. I could try and go in through the back. <laughs> Just to try and uh, sneak in a little bit. Ethan keeps a spare key around, but I should use the front. Oh. That's a good idea. What's this? Football game ads? I'm not sure if that's a real team or not. I'm guessing probably not. That's the girl's yeah. bike. That yeah. smile she had when I gave it to her. She could barely get on it back then. Now she's probably a bit too big for it, to be honest. Yes, Walk the cat up. food is under the sink. Yes, yes it is, Mother. Trust me. Oh, Samuel is here. I'll call you back. Samuel Higgs, as I live and breathe, has it really been over two years? Regardless, I'm so glad you finally made it. It's good to see you. What kept you? A 
trip down memory lane. I missed the funeral, but I made it to Nick's wake. You have to bring it in for a hug. It's a basswood back in town requirement. So good to see you. Even if I wish the circumstances were different. In times like these, we need the comforting touch of others. At least I do. It would have been more awkward if we just backed off. <laughs> so I just went for the hug. Also, have you spoken to Anna lately? No, why? Um, no reason. Okay. If you get the chance, we should catch up. We should really catch up. I'll see you inside. I'd like that. Still haven't actually got inside yet. <laughs> Feels like it's been forever. We're finally going in. Ugh, I'm not ready for this. You are, Sam. Here we go. I'm a bit socially awkward, I get it. I'm a bit like, oh, I could just go home and play VR games. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Wow. This is exactly what I expected. Mr. Samuel Higgs, Big Shot investigative reporter. Didn't think you'd ever be back in here. I'd gladly slash your tires, but that mean you couldn't leave town. And you are leaving. Just really embracing those Hicks stereotypes, huh, Joel? Gentlemen. Get you good old boys another round. Mighty kind of you, Declan. You're not worth the digs. Making friends already, I see. Declan, been a while. Hey, careful. I'd rather not be working tonight. And you always seem to angry up everyone's blood. Yep, I guess he does. He started it. Just here for Nick. Yeah, just here for Nick. It's all good. I'm only here to pay my respects to Nick. Nothing more, nothing less. Yeah, shame that. You watch yourself. What does Sam do here? What did he accuse the town of doing exactly? Everyone just seems a bit triggered. I think it's time I go put up a photo at the memorial board. That's what people do, right? I think, oh. Sammy, oh, it's been ages. It has. Tara? Oh, me? I've had this stomach thing lately, always oh, churning. Uh, and this thing with Nick, his car went up like a Sunday ham. He burned alive, you know. Have you met Hugh? He took over the old pharmacy just after you left. Um, no. The infamous Sam. I've read that article you wrote on the mine. You must have put in a lot of late work on that. Oh, maybe it's to do with the mine then. Took a lot of research. What did you think of it? I don't want to talk about it. Um, what do you think? <laughs> oh, uh, you read it. What do you think? Of the writing? Fine. Fine. Of the reporting? <laughs> Something that needed to be done. Many medicines are a bitter brew, but you still need to take them. That's nice of you to say. Oh, don't hesitate to drop by the pharmacy sometime. Oh, and Sam, you... But for now... I have a feeling you're not here for us. Oh, oh, right. Don't be a stranger, Sam. Yeah, maybe it's related to the mines then. That is a drum kit. Kathy, hi. Uh... Sam, you actually came. I did. Um, it's good to see you. It's been too long, Kathy. Has it? Joan was really hurt when you left town. Nick and I were never close after the breakup, and Joan's never had a lot of friends. Yeah. Um, Maybe don't break her heart this time when you leave town. All right? <sighs> um, 
this is, this is the best time to bring this up. All right, we'll look into it, I guess. Your daughter thinks Nick's crash doesn't make sense. She's a little girl who lost her father. She's confused right now. Don't you go encouraging her, or worse, putting those thoughts in her head? I frankly thought you knew better. Do you think she has a point? I think you should stay away from her. Perhaps that wasn't the best question to ask right now. But normally, if someone gets murdered, it's always the other half that's the main suspect straight away. So maybe... Or at least the ex, anyway. Obviously, they weren't going out. Empty slot for the picture. Can I pull it down? There you go. I think. There we go. Pin it. Pin it. Pull it down. Be proud of it. Sorry we lost touch. Sorry I lost touch. Rust up, big guy. This photo always looked weird. Nick could never keep a straight face. Happier times. I wonder who took that picture. The jungle team. Nick and Ashley. Bug was so small back then. So tiny. Nick and Walter. Those two were a great team. We drove straight to the sea after work on a Friday. Hell of a weekend. Nick sounds like a really cool guy. Look at us. Yeah. I like how his picture. It's such a tiny little thing, but his picture's the tiniest picture. You know what I mean? He's just trying to put his little memory up there, back off, all good. Samuel. Yeah, it's quite funny. Guess I lost the bet. Bet? Yeah, that bet you'd never come back to Basswood. Basswood? Not after you went careening out of town like a bat out of hell the instant that article broke bad. That's not why I left, you idiot. I won my bet. Well, Dennis, I won the bet I had with myself that you'd be an asshole right off the bat. <laughs> what a bet. That was a safe bet. What are you even doing here, Dennis? You and Nick become friends or something? Nope. He thought I was a drunk, which I am. And I thought he was a hack, which he was. This coming from the IT guy. Didn't know resetting passwords could give you a journalism degree. It can, but it does give me less patience for people who sling mud my way. Relax. I'm just playing. <laughs> At least tell me how you've been. I got a gun. Ha <laughs> uh, You don't pretend you care, let's be honest. Yeah, like you'd care. Uh, not too much. But shoot yourself if you want to be like that. Anyway, cheers to Nick. A man that, unlike us, people actually liked. Speaking of which... Oh no. I know who this is. Oh, this could get awkward again.
I don't know if we should go over there or not. I mean, the game's hinting. All right. So unfortunately, I can only show you guys uh, basically 30 minutes of the game. So I would love to show you guys more. Honestly, it gets really, 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 really good. Uh, but yeah, that's into this first episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, check out the link in the description below. You guys can pre-order the game right now, releasing on the 1st of December. And uh, yeah, see you guys soon. Enjoy your day. Be safe and bye-bye.